All right, y'all. So, as you are aware, we are on, I say, day two of our Mini Men Cat Challenge by Mog Simmer. And this wheel will spin for the next man that we make. So, let's go ahead and spin. We get the artist. Let me show you the base. Right, y'all. So, this is my base. And... His name is Pablo Holza. I randomized the last name to a point. And then I saw a whole another name. I decided to keep it. But anyway, his name is Pablo Holza. And his aspiration is the painter extraordinaire. He's creative. He's a perfectionist. And he's a loner. But with that said, I am going to go ahead and jump in and create him. And we'll be back when we're done. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so let me show you what I've done. Let me show you the first one I did. This was the first one I did. It's very simple. I didn't like it as much as I did the other, so let me show you the real one I did. This is my take on a artist. My idea is that he's a college student, so he needs to carry his books everywhere. He has to go in between classes to paint, and he not only does he paint, he does graffiti, he likes to paint girls' nails. Anywhere he gets to paint, he will. So my idea is that he also designed in, like, a print shop his own painted form of his shirt. So he wears his own merchandise. He made this shirt himself. This is his backpack to carry his books. And then he's always dirty because he's always got some kind of paint on his face. He forgets to wipe it off or he gets in the back of his hand and he gets all over his face. He uh, wears a hearing aid in one ear because he lost hearing in it from all the music he used to listen to all the time. It made his hearing go. And he has long hair and a back cap. And he wears these little gloves on his hands to protect him because he gets arthritis really bad from constant painting. And he likes to wear comfortable shoes and the socks his mom gave him. So he showcases it because it popped color on him. So, with that said, let me know what you guys think about him, and I will see you guys later. Bye!